Good afternoon, everyone. I want to bring you an update on the main story of the day, which has been the storm damage in parts of southern Worcester County. These are pictures out of Webster, where the Weather Service has arrived, and they have confirmed a tornado touched down earlier on this morning. You can see some of the significant damage through the central part of town. Dudley also reporting some storm damage. The Weather Service will be there throughout the afternoon and into the evening. They're going to take a look at all the evidence, see how exactly how strong this tornado was, its path was, its width, where it started and where it ended. But a lot of damage there in Webster this afternoon, and the Weather Service will continue their survey throughout the rest of the day. I'm meteorologist Eric Fisher. I've been watching these storms for you throughout the course of the morning and now heading into the afternoon hours. This is a look at the storm as it made its way out of northeastern Connecticut. This one showed up very well on radar. Take a look at the clock at the top of the screen at 943. This was moving its way into the Dudley area where there is storm damage and the Weather Service will likely head over in that direction. Some of the tightest rotation was right over Webster. You can see that green, which is strong winds heading off toward the south and east. And then you have those reds, which are strong winds heading off to the the north and west, and so we have that rotation on radar. It moved over towards Sutton with the rotation starting to weaken at that point and then fell apart as it moved up toward the Grafton area and weakened, moving off toward the north and east. And we can see that rotation on radar as well. This is a look at the general track of that rotating storm right near the Quinnebog area of northeastern Connecticut and then moving its way up through Dudley and Webster and off to the north and east before weakening earlier on today. Current look at the radar heavy rainfall now in southeastern Massachusetts. Some areas of flash flooding on the roads will all be possible as we head through the afternoon and a couple more pop-up storms are possible for central mass and new hampshire as we head into the afternoon hours i do believe that the tornado threat is much lower here as we head into the afternoon i think we've moved past the highest risk time to see one of these spin-up storms but to reiterate the national weather service is on the ground in webster they've confirmed that tornado touchdown it is the third tornado in southern worcester county in just the last couple of weeks as we had a couple others in the middle of the night just a little over a week ago. We'll keep you updated. You can always get the latest on cbsboston.com and we'll have a full report. Our crews are on the scene in Webster coming up tonight in the WBZ News at 6 o'clock. We'll see you then.